So scientists need to develop drugs against bacteria or against viruses or against fungi and against bacteria we have a group of drugs called antibiotics. So antibiotics work against bacteria, trying to kill bacteria and antiviral drugs work against viruses. Now it's important for scientists to test these drugs A to make sure that they're safe and B to make sure that they work. So how do we test them? Well I can test them on animals but one of the problems with that is some people think that that may be cruel against the animal. Uh, we can test it on human tissue samples in the lab or we can test it using computer models and they're the three ways that we can test drugs. Now we should be careful that we only use antibiotics where necessary and we shouldn't overuse them. One of the dangers is, is that bacteria may become resistant against that particular antibiotic. And one example where this has happened is a bacteria called MRSA which has become resistant to a, an antibiotic called methicillin. So how do we test a drug to see if it works and to see if it's safe? Well, I take my drug here which I want to test and I need to compare it against something. So I compare it against a fake drug called a placebo. Now in a blind trial, there's a patient, I give one patient the real drug and one patient the placebo and I watch the effects and I can compare the two. That's in a blind trial where I know which is the placebo and which is the actual real drug. In a double blind trial, the patient doesn't know which drug is the placebo and which drug is the real drug and neither do I, somebody else does. So I'm blind and the patient is blind to which is the placebo and which is the real drug. That's a double blind trial.